anything that you'd want kind of an up feeling for this really provides it Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I want to do a re-review on this Amp Citrate. Amp Citrate is a supplement that I was really blown away with when I first tried it. I said it was pretty much my favorite supplement. I think I had tried it for a few weeks at that point. Eventually, somehow, some way, I stopped taking it every day and I've slowly started to incorporate a little bit more after I've started to retest DMA and DMHA. I was going to do DMHA next after DMA, but for some reason, I was having some weird experiences with it, some bad, some good, and I ended up trying this Amp citrate a lot and I feel like I have a really good pin down opinion on this one so let's jump right into it it's pretty decently priced you get 133 servings at 75 milligrams each I do recommend slightly more than one serving but at the same time you get 133 this is a very exotic supplement so I do think if it is $55 it is worth it quick little overview of this this is kind of like a medium strength stimulant there is a few stimulants that are stronger than this which are DMA and DMHA definitely stronger than this but then there are are ones that are a lot weaker than this I would say this is kind of on par with teacrine but it's got more of a DMAA style feel but it's kind of on par with how long teacrine lasts I would say this lasts definitely longer than dynamine a little bit longer than caffeine so it's kind of in the middle range and I think that's kind of why I like this so much and why I recommend this so much usually with the energy on this one I get probably three to four hours of solid energy maybe up to like five or six most of the time the coffee unless you rarely have coffee coffee's really not going to last to that three or four hour mark you'll probably get an hour and a half two hours tops out of this one so you do get a longer feeling of just being up and for some reason caffeine kind of has more of a crash with this one this one felt a lot more it's kind of like an even keel but it was never too much the pros of this supplement in my opinion this is the perfect blend of it's really going to work but it's not going to be overkill so many times with dma and dmha i really do appreciate how long they last i have to really really be careful careful with it and something like uh, amp citrate it's just so nice because if you're kind of craving to have a lot you could have a decent amount of this and it won't mess you up like if you were to take four to five scoops at least for me of dmaa throughout the day i would completely mess me up because i only really can take it once at the beginning of the day and it lasts so long if you were to take it in the middle of the day it's going to probably be there a little bit in the morning when you wake up so it's just too long this is right down the middle. It's pretty, generally pretty safe. A lot of people could just try it out. Even people who are sensitive to stuff, you're probably not gonna have a bad time with this one. In my opinion, it's just the perfect blend of having a good amount of stimulation, but also being safe. Well, relatively safe. The only reason you'd be taking this is for an extra little jolt. In my opinion, this kind of works well with a lot of people. The main pro is that it has an amazing blend of energy to being safe at the same time. It's actually not that much cons in my opinion, but the cons, number one is the taste. Now, I don't really wanna blame this one 100% because it tastes the same, in my opinion, as DMA and DMHA. They all kinda of taste bad, in my opinion. Teacrine tastes the worst, so it's not even near as bad. If you put a lot of this in your drink, you are gonna notice it. I've noticed that one, one and a half scoops, you don't taste anything. Two, you might taste a little bit of something, but it doesn't really bother me that much. But if you get up and so those high scoops you are going to taste it i actually think this would be worth it even if it was 75 to 100 dollars just because of how exotic this is you can't get anything like this anywhere else you pretty much only have access to maybe like yohembi and caffeine so exotic so good and so worth it i mean i think it would almost be worth 100 dollars. this is i believe 55 dollars for 133 servings i would recommend everyone start out with one and a half scoops and based on that one and a half scoops if you want more or less kind of go from there also take it in the beginning of the day you could probably redose it once in the middle if you want to as well as far as the price to energy ratio i would usually go about three to five scoops a day if i'm going to take this you are going to run through the packet a little bit quicker than you would with something like dma and dmha dma and dmha some of them i think are cheaper and stronger but at the same time I just like this one so much because it's so likable and so safe. You could recommend this to way more people, probably like five times the more amount of people because of how much problems you get with DMA and DMHA. It's just so much more balanced. If you're looking for the maximum amount of energy for a price, I mean, that's gotta be DMA or DMHA. But in my opinion, this is still worth it. Like I said, if this was $100, I still think this would be worth it. I would recommend this for just about almost anybody. I mean, the only people I wouldn't recommend this for is people who really 
really don't like stimulants, who don't like caffeine. This kind of works well with anything. If you got somebody who's working long hours, it would go good with them. If you have a pre-workout, you could toss a little bit of this in, maybe use a little bit less of your pre-workout. It's gonna have a unique feel. If you take DMAA or DMHA, you could maybe do half DMAA, half this, you know what I mean? Get a little bit of both. Same with caffeine. You could take a little caffeine, a little bit of this. It's just gonna blend really good. It's not gonna be crazy. Same with teacrine. Almost everything goes good with this. Almost everyone goes good with this. If you're somebody who doesn't like stims and doesn't like caffeine, that's the only person that I would not recommend this for, but it goes good with almost every situation, studying, gaming, anything that you'd want kind of an up feeling for, this really provides it. I really, really enjoy it. And you could also take it by itself and just, you know, skip out the caffeine for a few days and just kind of let yourself recharge. But anyways, guys, Amp Citrate is an amazing, amazing supplement. I've enjoyed it since I very first started taking it and I enjoy it now. And I recommend it to just about everybody. It's a fantastic supplement. If you're looking for any sort of energy boosting effects or focus boosting effects, but Anyways, guys, we're on the road to 50,000 subscribers, and I couldn't do it without any of you guys. Hope you guys are the best. I'm having a great day out here. Hopefully, I'm having a great day at home. See you all in the next video. Peace.